Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with the free pick in the White Sox versus Cubs Major League Baseball matchup on Tuesday, July 25th, 2023. Here on YouTube, I do tons of free pick videos, so be sure to subscribe to our channel. We do free picks every day. SportsChatPlace.com, PickDogs.com, right here on YouTube, as well as across social media and our live shows. And when you give out that many free picks, you're bound to like some games more than others. And to find out which games those are, as well as to get best bets from the world's best handicappers, head on over to our website, PickDogs.com, and click on the Premium Picks tab. While you're there, use the discount code PICK to get 15% off your purchases of $19 or more, including our Christmas in July yearly specials, which are going on throughout the month of July. It is our lowest pricing of the year on long-term packages. We also now have the Pick Dogs Dime Club geared towards the large bankroll players that asked for the Dime Club. So call the toll-free number on the website, text the number on the website, talk to a live person and see if the Dime Club's for you. But let's head to the South Side where the White Sox are hosting the North Siders, the Chicago Cubs, in on in Tuesday Major League Baseball action. Man, I love this stuff. I lived in Chicago for a long time, and while I didn't love those Chicago winters, I did love my my Sox Cubs games, and those were certainly some of the highlights of all my years in Chicago. It's a great city with great people, regardless if you're a Cubs fan or a White Sox fan. In fact, a lot of the Cubs fans really, let's face it, they don't even live in Chicago or anywhere remotely close. They live in the far out suburbs and then when you say where you live they say Chicago even it's basically you know no closer than Boston is to New York City but anyways that's a different story for a different day but right now you know we look at this one between the Sox and the Cubs and you know for the Mayor's Trophy so even while both these teams aren't really seen as contending this year the White Sox are way out of it they don't have a shot at the wild card they don't have a shot at the division they are pretty much done and probably thinking what are they going to do at the trade deadline at this point meanwhile the Cubs as quietly as it's been you know they're only five and a half out in the wild card so i mean the cubs generally wheelers dealers at the trade deadline i expect them still to be so um they're only a few games three games under 500 and five and a half back in that national league wild card while they would have some wood to chop to get there really it's only three teams and you've got 60 games it's a reach but it certainly is possible so what do the cubs do at this point are we going to see them deal guys like Marcus Stroman? I'm not really sure, but that's the guy who they would get the most for at this point. I think the guy they would rather deal is today's starter, Kyle Hendricks, who you know has had his share of ups and downs for the Cubs, but we've also seen that he's now come back, and he is certainly a viable option at pitcher, though he's not the same guy that he was a few years ago that was simply unbeatable at Wrigley Field. Michael Kopech on the mound for the White Sox. I think this guy's heading in the right direction. I think it's taken a little bit longer than most of us White Sox fans have hoped, but I'll tell you what, he's going to be good enough here, and there's one thing that I know about, you know, living from living in Chicago, man, those White Sox and the White Sox fans, they love beating them some Chicago Cubs. I'm going to take the White Sox in this one, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks today, putting your bets in, be sure to use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com. Our betting tools are 100% free, and the way they work, they show you just how often all the bets on the board today actually hit. Then they show you today's odds, and from there, you can assess the risk-reward, living your, <laughs> putting yourself on the bets that come in the most and pay the most. That's how you make money, betting on sports.